It's been 288 days since the Bobcats played their last snap at Peden Stadium. As it opened up its 2022 season against the Florida Atlantic Owls, fans may notice a thing or two looks different inside the stadium. Not only is it a new season for the Bobcats, but they're also playing on brand new turf. In addition is the naming of Frank Solich Field to honor the former Bobcat legend. Head coach Tim Alba talks about the importance of tonight's win on a night like this. We, we talked about it as, as, a, as a team, uh, you know, uh, Coach doesn't, doesn't want us to, but, but um, winning the first one uh, uh, with Coach's name on it is, is, is uh, special. So Litch spent 16 seasons at the helm for the Bobcats. Throughout his time, he gathered a record of 115 wins and 82 losses. He also earned the title of winning as coach in Mid-American Conference history. Solich retired just two years ago, but his name now sits on the sideline with the Bobcats. And as the season progresses, the new turf will benefit them, especially when playing in difficult weather conditions. It was, it was beautiful, uh, and uh, it's a difference. It was wet out there, and I don't, I didn't, see, you know, we had one slip from our kicker. The rain didn't put a damper on Ohio's fight. Despite the Owls making things interesting late in the fourth quarter, the Bobcats' defense held as they came out on top, 41 to 38. An official field dedication ceremony for Frank Solich Field will take place on senior night, October 22nd, when the Bobcats face off against Northern Illinois. Reporting for Bobcat Showcase, I'm Marie Manessi.